Hey everyone, welcome to episode 19 of our super replay of Overblood 2. I'm Dan Reichert again, and we've got Andrew Reiner over there again. I think we should bomb the waterfall. Bomb it with a bomb. Uh, Reiner's been doing some reading up. Oh, no. Uh, I did the Tim. reading. Okay, Tim. That is Tim Terry's voice with the controller again. But I couldn't read it, and then Reiner read it, and so he said to bomb the waterfall. I can't read it, which is why I never know what I'm doing in Super Replays. Okay, that's the truth. And then we've got Ben Hansen over there. Hello. He's got a live mic again there. You're always sitting in here, but sometimes you're like an actual guest. Yeah, I'm still confused how that works. Sometimes yeah. he's playing his fun character live mic again. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes when I'm introduced, I'm guessing if people aren't familiar with replay history, they're really confused as to who this extra voice is, or they assume it's just Dan with some sort of sinus infection. Mm -hmm. All right. And we, by the way, we just made more progress in the last 20 seconds than we made. How in would the last anybody hour. ever know that? Okay, video games. There's always something behind the waterfall, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But you never bomb behind a waterfall, right? Not generally. You don't. Not even in Zelda, you don't. Usually, you don't get the opportunity because no. bombs don't usually work in water. I guess you don't bomb it, yeah, because in like Link to the Past, you got to go to the fairy fountain, but you walk through the waterfall. Yep. In Metal Gear Three, you just go back there and bang Eve. I or think Ava. <laughs> yeah, Ava. I think Ava. Ava. The big, the big problem <laughs> was that we thought that we had already gotten a diva piece on top of the waterfall, right? Or like in the little stream. So that's what really held us back, I think. So now it's just a quick jaunt through this endless maze, and we'll be right back <laughs> on track. Lost Woods. I think in we will space. make progress. Within the next, I think we just got to get back to the the room, and then we put the thing in, and then we see a, a last boss or something, don't we? I, so I think this is assumption. the last episode. Oh, it is. I mean, I don't think so. Seven is. No, I think I think we have like another four episodes. No, he's saying oh, the, episodes of the show. Of the show. Of the show. Yeah, yeah. It's so confusing. <laughs> I like that it's almost a reward getting to finally see another cutscene, but then when the cutscene starts, we're immediately in pain. Yeah, like, there is no reward in Overblood Blood yeah. Two at any point. Do we get another pizza party for beating this game? You know what it's like? It's it's like yes. when uh, we do. Awesome. I will give you guys, you three guys, a pizza party. We get a pizza party. Yeah. Yes. Uh, I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Tim, you're gonna say something really interesting. <laughs> was I? Oh, yeah. But it, it was about the cutscenes. You know what I mean? It's like when you're you're at the dentist and they're you know filling a cavity and they are uh, drilling away your tooth, and then you're like, oh, this is the worst. Um, but you don't say it like that, not as clearly, because there's a dentist hands in, yeah. your, in your in your mouth. Uh, and then they go to the flossing. Flossing is not fun either. When they do it, they, they're way I'm too okay aggressive. Um, but it's better than the uh, you know the cavity filling. So that's like Overblood Two. Overblood Two is like dental work, with probably less blood. And Dan, you, you talk... should have reviewed this back in the day. Yeah, it would've been a good analogy. You talk like you have dentist hands in your mouth. That's what I was gonna say. Regularly? Yeah. Yeah. That's how every sound that comes out of your mouth sounds. I always wondered who that guy was behind you with just one finger in your mouth. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's really expensive. <laughs> yeah, the dentist, the, the no-look dentist that stands behind yeah, you. Well, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm glad we get insurance. That I guy's, reach around. That guy's pricey. <laughs> I can reach around his good Motley Crue album. <laughs> <laughs> they got really lazy <laughs> with their innuendos. <laughs> They call him Dr. Reach around because he touches your <laughs> Doop 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 over here, Jesus. Uh, what was the Seinfeld move? Stopping short? Oh, anti dentite? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Stopping short on the anti dentite. The, uh, the dentist who, uh, who turns Jewish for the Jewish jokes in Seinfeld, Walter White. Brian Cranston. From Breaking Bed. Yeah. Yep. Same character. Exact same character. I have no yeah. idea. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Uh, Speckle of fluoride. That is Walter White. I want to see him in every role. I want to see I all, everything he's ever done just because of who he became in that show. Have you seen that X-Files clip that uh, Vince Gilligan showed to AMC to tell them, like, okay, this is the guy we need. Watch this clip. Oh, no. There's just a clip of him in the back of, like, Mulder's car. Just I don't even remember what's going Vince on. Vince like Gilligan a, wrote that episode. Oh, did he? Mm -hmm. oh, okay. It was just like a minute long clip, and Cranston's just awesome. And it was like the "Hey, look at this guy. This guy's awesome." Clip. Oh, cool. Yeah. Dan, I'm still upset you don't listen to that podcast. There's a great Breaking I don't Bad listen to podcast podcasts. called Breaking Bad Insider, and for every episode, they, it's just like 45 minutes with the creators, editors, actors, and they just. Where do you have the set. time to? Yeah. You listen to every podcast on the internet. Yeah, what, I do. Where they, do you find the time to do this? They get I, the actors and everything on it. Yeah. Oh, that's it's great. great. Um. And like you know, sound designers, composers, everything. Ugh. But um, yeah, I don't know. I just I never have earbuds out of my ears. But don't you play like when I go home? I'm just playing games till I go to sleep. Pretty much. I, like I listen no, to podcasts. He doesn't. His gamer score is like fifty. He also just got an Xbox like within the last year. Also, and I have, so calls it the dumb console. Unless, 
Dan yelled at me and said, let's not make that public that you called that the dumb console. Let me just announce it on replay. But to be fair to my gamer score, you're right. But I do have multiple accounts because I used to play on my roommate's Xbox. So I play on that a lot. And it doesn't have Xbox Live. And I have like four quadrillion on that. Why I have never just... seen you play an Xbox 360 in my life. What do you mean? Like online? We're not even well, certainly friends. never online. I, I'm trying to think if I've ever seen you with a 360 controller in your hand. <laughs> it burns my skin like a cross to a vampire. <laughs> there was that one time you had to move it because it was on top of a PS3 controller. But I had oh. that stick and I just kind of pushed it. <laughs> oh, that's true. <laughs> my 360 stick. <laughs> Three stick ski. Okay, guys. Thank you. <laughs> we think we're going to get to a boss battle after this. Who is the, who's the boss going to be, though? We killed Stretchy Arm Man. Who? Uh, Stretch Armstrong it's Green the Boy. the AI. And we killed Kondo. Or that's what you meant. Kondo, that yeah. guy, yeah. Wait, the AI? Yeah, the, uh, what's her name? Oh, there, she has a name. Um, one of the... the oh, the Alucard. I think it's Edie, Alucard right? lady. Yeah, it's something. Oh, okay. something oh like the that. cleavage man. Cleavage man. Yeah. No, the, um, the Alucard lady behind yeah, the thing. Yeah, with all the cleavage. Are we sure. ready for this? Yeah, let's go in. ready? Do something. It's gonna be quiet. But I was gonna ask, oh. what do we think the story is so guns. far? Hold on. We'll find out. Akano! Hey, it's good to see you guys. <laughs> Where's the doc? He's guarding the hover. You okay? Things got heavy, but I'm okay now. <laughs> the bridge is hit bad. The ship's got to be controlled from the main computer room. I that think way. They're with this elevator. Why wasn't the bridge protected? Every once in a while, the colonel sounds sense. like wacko. There's something strange going on. Ringo, you mean? Uh, but we don't have time to Ring, worry about Ringo it now. Star. We've got to stop this no. ship. No, he's doing a John Lennon impersonation. The second volley of missiles. You sure? Yeah. Oh. Okay. They all sound alike. I hear you. That's, that's Animaniacist. <laughs> Warner Brotherhood. <laughs> oh, this idiot. You finally arrived. Oh, yeah, so there's this guy, and then we got Boobatron back there. Is that her name? Boobatron? Yeah. yeah. And you must be Zeno. Zeno Razul. Zeno Razul? Zeno? Raz. <laughs> I am honored that you know my name. I can also identify 20 species of snakes. <laughs> You've got to stop the ship. There's no reason for you to do this. We've got a hull drive that can repair the Earth's atmosphere. I see. That doesn't matter now. It never it's looks at anyone he's talking to. to change my course. <laughs> Your course is taking you and everyone else on this ship on a one-way trip. You're not to even trying to explain those floating torches, are they? I'll watch perimeter. Nope. Star you really want this cutscene to go on longer, Dan, where they stop and explain and everything that's Take my floating the torches, for instance. <laughs> the most advanced technology in the world. <laughs> no one will be alive to push the buttons. They laughed at me but when I passed it. We told you <laughs> there's no need for this. Need? It's what I want. What you want. Why don't you know exactly what that is? <laughs> I thought you'd never that's ask. Good. It's quite simple, really. impediment. <laughs> Say something. I'll tell you right now. Listen carefully. I am going to establish my own nation with the power of this ship. What? Your nation? Yes. A new nation High ruled five. by me. <laughs> I shall call it Xeno Meridian. <laughs> it will mark a new beginning for this world. This ship will be my home and sovereign land, and all of Earth well, and eventually your other planets ship will obey or your me ship is falling apart. destroyed. Think what you guys want to join my new band, Zeno Meridian? Oh, it's a good name for a band. Yeah. Sounds like an XBLA game. It makes very good sense. <laughs> <laughs> like a shooter. Oh, Zeno Class of yeah. Meridian. Dual analog shooter. <laughs> Zeno Meridian. And I have all of the might in the world. This is a flying fortress designed to sustain life for many years. It's falling apart. He it sounds like Lo Pan from Big Trouble in Little China. Oh, I hear it a world. little bit. Yeah, oh, Jack Button, Mr. Oh, Button. Yeah. Yeah. The ability to destroy the Earth with bits. With eggs? And survive the, the ability to destroy the Earth with eggs. With eggs. eggs. <laughs> eggs. <laughs> yeah. Just TPing houses. Like the, <laughs> like the character from Clerks that's just investigating the and eggs now? and mouthing them. <laughs> this momentous occasion? I think fireworks are have, you, order. have you guys ever had your house egged or anything like that? Mm -mm. I woke up one morning and my van was egged outside now, my house. I my it's bad news. That, that stuff sorry. like crusts on the vehicle and house. I also heard that clean. if you take an Oreo cookie and lick it, like you take, you twist it out and ha oh god. 
Uh, you, you twist in half, lick it, and stick in someone's car. It'll take off the paint during the winter. I've heard that was like baloney. If you throw baloney on uh, the hood during the summer, I think, isn't it? Baloney. South twelve. Wait, which one's the Paragon option here? <laughs> you guys, what do you think? Enough's uh, enough. Yeah. I. Took, Any suggestion? Did it pick it for you? Pity. It just went away. No people are no help at all. So many cities and so little time to kill. But if you're not going to help me. I'll just have to pick one myself. What? No. No, don't bomb a city. Target Los Angeles. Should an old man just tackle him? LA exists. Just push him off the side. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, hit him. Hit him with your hand. Smash his old head into the keyboard. Use the lightsaber you have in your pocket. <laughs> do and your laser gun and bazooka. <laughs> do anything besides let him do his thing. <laughs> just shoot the bazooka at him. <laughs> with one it's not complicated. <laughs> Goddamn bazooka. There we oh, go. Yeah. She's got the right idea. I was trained for this. <laughs> How crude. What do I do now? Step away from that console. Zeno, do it. You can enter three more destinations you want that thing to target, but then no I more, man. Demonstrate my power to the entire world. Cool it. This cuts to Alderaan getting blown up. <laughs> and nothing can stop me from ruling as I deserve to rule. We could just shoot you right now, Zeno, dude. Into a fight room. Mad. <laughs> Not mad. A little angry, maybe. Monty Python character. Not mad. He's just I'm disappointed. Ready to put a bullet in that smart -ass mouth of yours. Unfortunately, my gun Agent is Lanabeca. one hunk of plastic. Not me. Yeah, there is no texture on that gun <laughs> no. whatsoever. The great well, it's, it's like airheads that just filled plastic ones with like hot <laughs> sauce. <laughs> in a game where, I love that movie. <laughs> yeah, in a game where most, most people don't have faces, I guess. Yeah. You can't ask for a trigger. When you get all riled up like that, Agent Lanabeca. Linebacker. Linebacker. I just don't. Agent Linebacker, Chris Go Linebacker, <laughs> worst female Shoot. protagonist name ever. Shoot. I think you're in a band. There we go. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Oh, oh. Just do that right away next time. <laughs> you foolish little people. Did you really think you could stop me the way you can stop the others? He, he's still talking. In every way, and you shall learn this truth along Hands with down by your sides, everybody. <laughs> but don't worry. You don't have long to wait. Good rib because hand there. Is the day that you Yum. And the rest you have 400 your grenades in your pocket. Nick rib hands. I do have a lot of grenades. Don't do he it. says his name Just more than anybody else. Shot him once in the shoulder, and it's like, oh, nope, not quite. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing codes. <laughs> no, we're not gonna get to episode 20, are we? This is gonna end at 19. I wanted that clean 20. I think we have a long ways to go yet. I think we do too. You really? Yeah. I think we have to piece Los Angeles back together. <laughs> Look for all the diva pieces of the Los Angeles. <laughs> the diva pieces of Los Angeles sounds like a bad band, die, too. But it's a or reality show. To yeah. For a new beginning, as I pave the the real diva pieces. Of of <laughs> Dan, you're world. funny. Yeah, you're funny, Dan. Yeah. Everyone's just doing real good. Just yeah. Or a couple of funny now. funny guys. Done is done. Who's the couple? Nothing. Do you I guess four. Those now, hands are attached nothing. to a body? It's, it are they just the like It's the Colossus from God of War 2. a 15-foot hand. <laughs> what? Yeah. Oh, I had another condo more. Fart app. Fart app. I, I deleted it. I Fart app him, Tim. Oh, no. Fart app him. <laughs> Summon the grandma. Oh, he's turning into a woman. <laughs> turning into Judy Dench. <laughs> <laughs> Meets, like, Leonard Nimoy and... <laughs> Finally. No. He's not a traveler. Two tastes, two great tastes. <laughs> oh, now you shoot him nine times. <laughs> so, I guess that was three. I don't you know. Think I'm a monster? No, a Kano is right. I am a traveler, just like him. So if you call me a monster, you'd have to call your friend over there. How many forms is he gonna have? We have the same no idea. No. Just one. Okay. Or I guess two: human and beast. Yeah, um, if he doesn't morph further. Probably W2. W2? Giant Andros head. 1040 EZ. I want every last boss to turn into a giant Andros head. It'd be amazing. And like the Andros thing where it's just the brain and the eyes that come after yeah, you. Yeah, you're talking about like the, uh, like the special effects. Oh, cool. Like, uh, polygon. No, I like Andros the 16. Like, look the blue rain They're both head. good. Look ahead. What was the blue rain part for? Blue rain? It said look a blue rain head. Or blue rain head? I don't know. Oh. Look a blue rain head. <laughs> <laughs> you animal. You monster. <laughs> you <will abuse> me. <laughs> okay. 
can you be so blind? Blind? It's like a weird Carno to just start radiating like blue light and they can have a cool blind, traveler battle. Human. Okay, Judy right. Judy Dench, Leonard Nimoy, Adam West. <laughs> and Fisthead. I have no need for an Classic and DC villain. And Chicken Lake. <laughs> chicken Lake? You've chicken Lake? Frozen Chicken Lake? <laughs> chicken Lake, <laughs> Minnesota? Good ice fishing. Yeah. For chickens. <laughs> chickens. <laughs> Everyone cuts their holes way too small. Don't expect a whole chicken live with scales. Like a velociraptor. Minimum. Yeah, they can't survive during the winter, so you gotta wonder where they go. They go the chickens? The lake. Yeah. Chicken lake. One time, uh, a neighbor on our lake lot was ice fishing, and just minding his business, probably drinking a beer or two, and all of a sudden, a black lab came up through his ice hole. What? A live one? Yes. It fell in the ice in the fish house next to him and was just looking for the nearest exit. So it just jumped up through his... Can you imagine <laughs> that? Can you imagine that? I would have a heart attack. Yeah. Oh my god. And after playing Resident Evil... All the things. Yeah. After playing Resident Evil, I would kill that thing. Oh my <laughs> god. Nice or seeing the thing. <laughs> but I was like, yes, I'm alive. And then he's getting stabbed in the head. Did he have to... I mean, ice fishing holes are generally pretty small. Did he have yeah. to cut it wider then? No, I don't think so. I think it made it through it. Wow, that's a big ice fishing hole. <laughs> to like get its arms up and get ready oh, to dive man. through the air. What the hell? Dogs are awesome. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> Overblood 2. I'm a black... I love how this game has this complicated sci-fi plot and we're just bewildered by a black lab emerging from an ice fishing hole. We're just looking for anything else to distract ourselves. That's what I'm willing to trade for. If you cooperate with me, I'll call off the attacks and you will be saving the lives of millions of people around the world. Akano, don't do it. He wants the grandma spirit? Uh-oh. That's ours. We earned that. Yes, Akano. I want your power. The power contained in your blood. Oh, your Give it to him. The end. It will enhance my abilities and strength to the left. To the left. Why don't it will you enhance and strengthen my abilities to the and left. And cooperate with me. Your sister Nina did. What? Oh, oh that's you. right. He's you got a were the sister. one who experimented Wait, with no, my Galarians. sister's blood to try oh, and get her this. power. Huh. I'm yes. so lost. <laughs> I was the one who performed the DNA blood transfer experiments on your sister Nina. But don't be <laughs> so upset about it. I can assure you that she that cooperated sister completely him? through oh. You're a liar, Egon! Nina would never cooperate with a monster like you! Egon! Do you think uh, Then you greatly underestimate the efficacy uh, of the uh, <sighs> No! That was weird. I don't know why we did that. No, I don't believe it! <laughs> My techniques tricked her into cooperating. Patty cake. Uh, that is, at first. Just mutated to talk more. For like <laughs> ten minutes. You killed her. Monologue didn't form. You? He was getting winded. No. Did he get monster I strength to keep monologue talking? Monologue form. <laughs> Filibuster. I was so close to creating the favorite Mega Man weapon. I like that. But it was all lost when your sister decided she'd rather die no. than contribute John to Carey is the boss. That's what you get. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Did he do a filibuster? He's a windy guy. Yeah, now, he talks a lot. It's your turn to decide whether or not you want to cooperate and with And he's me. reporting for duty. If you do, millions <laughs> oh, yeah. of people will be saved. If you don't, millions will die. What is your answer? Uh-oh. Let Tim choose. What if it froze at this point? Like, honestly froze, like we couldn't get past it. Pizza party. Let those people <laughs> die. Yes. <laughs> the Akano. pepperonis. And you pop. win. I'll do what you ask. So, <laughs> give him your blood. <laughs> Where, what button is that? Is that square? Or later. Akano, Transfusion don't button. Listen to him. Rotate the right stick. Can't oh. do this. Don't Mr. Mosquito. <laughs> oh, but huh. you see, you have no choice. You have to trust me. Besides, once Akano has been subjected to my treatment, he will begin to see mm, the wisdom. Shouldn't pause it on that. <laughs> no, I don't trust him. You want. <laughs> hmm. Just make what sure your you hold up like your end of the deal and call off the attack. <laughs> We're just going to start the uh, regular uh, worry about that. exam. <laughs> <laughs> we'll heal that right up with some antibiotics. <laughs> 
<laughs> Anti. Akana, you can't cooperate with him. <laughs> There's no way we can trust him to keep his word. No, even just if step on the scale so we wants. can get your. There's got to be another way weight. out of this. Don't go along with him. <laughs> the worst doctor ever. <laughs> I'm sorry, Doctor Paz a lot. But no, it uh, says here that you have to pay a uh, twenty-five dollar. Uh, <sighs> okay. <sighs> now. That's what I was gonna say. It was it. It's like we finished each other's. Ah, oh, that's cute. Sandwich. <laughs> Sandwiches. <laughs> Okay. It was just for the monologue. It was. Or, Wait, his arms are still kind of... No, no, no. <laughs> Needed bigger me. lungs for all the talking he did. Did yeah. he shrink? I think so. <laughs> just a car. They're going into the carbonite hole. Bye, guys. See you guys. <laughs> what? Please entertain our game. Maybe now you have to play as other characters. Like Whoop. in the part in 7 where Cloud's in the coma. Uh, what if a black lab head just came out of that hole? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> licking the screen. A giant one. It's like the, like dead the dead dogs. dogs. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, if we ever do screen wipes and stuff like that for, for this, can we just have a lab going across the screen? Do you remember the, you remember the flying Reiner head transition? Yeah. Oh, boy. You know what would be the opposite of a black lab coming out of an ice fishing hole? Over the vortex two? queen. Oh. <laughs> going in your fishing hole. Just God. I would kill myself so fast. <laughs> you want to go ahead with this? <laughs> of Unless I had a bunch of dolphins to stab its jaw. This ship has the best technology this world has ever seen. Good thing it's you carry that dolphin spear around Master with you all the time. You know, people doubted me, but... <laughs> it's really starting to rot. There's a dolphin yeah. head on a stick. <laughs> I was there. to work every day. There was not as many people asking for them at Dick's Sporting Goods. <laughs> that might be the most disturbing <laughs> visual ever. <laughs> you just painted some, some stars on its head. It's rotting. Gets by his desk all the time. Gross. There's a button really on the stick. It's stupid <laughs> location sound. I like that. I like that idea. Let me ask Dolphin stick. The old world could not change fast enough. Oh, what if we have to do this over the again? Oh, these guys got to shut up. The whole drive, but it will ultimately fall I still don't understand this guy's plan. It's to destroy Earth despair. so he can orbit and Earth in his spaceship and, and reason, people will want to live with him? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Like, it'll be like Wally. He's trying to destroy the atmosphere. Shut up, Dan. I'm not allowed to make Pixar. References. No, you aren't. <laughs> is he trying to destroy the atmosphere, or is the atmosphere already destroyed? There's a hole in the ozone or something. Oh yeah, that's right. It will never be I don't know if it's because of a missile. Or... I want to pull you guys. Um, dolphin pull us? I want to dolphin pull you guys. It takes one with the courage and the knowledge and the resources to tell the world the truth. What are the odds that this doesn't kick back in in a boss fight? Ayano was a corporate puppet. Too blinded by his save? own yeah. short-sighted love of money, as they told. Is that a dolphin or a fart app or a dolphin fart? Right. <laughs> That's a dolphin fart. That was like you know, like you get you take a, a balloon and you blow it up and then you you stretch out the uh, you know the place that you blow it up. Yeah. Uh, it's like doing that to a dolphin's blow hole, basically, and it makes that sound. And we recorded it just for this episode. Did you download a fart app in the middle of this episode? Yeah, I did. <laughs> What's going on here? You gotta do Atomic Fart. Listen, they're our sponsor. The I think we should come this out and say it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I downloaded iFart, and they have like a separate app store to buy more farts. Each is <laughs> microtransaction farts. Yeah, it's 2012. <laughs> I don't... This is what Steve Jobs This is what our so grandpa proud. grandfathers fought for. <laughs> so Storing the beaches of Normandy so we could fart from our phones. <laughs> We're so close to ouch my balls really happening. Oh man. I, I would VBR that every time. Oh yeah, hang on, this looks cool. No, it doesn't. Bright stuff. Is it a supermarket? They're in a cub food. Oh, yeah. it was great. Super soldiers. <laughs> so when the military was no Are those involved, test tubes? Ayano yeah, right? They're just the ghost project. test tubes. Continue They're just the like holograms of test tubes. This the is the where we'll put them. The ghost of test tube pass. <laughs> Budget. My sister was the first subject for this project. <laughs> yes, she was. The project advanced rapidly because of her until she decided she couldn't take it any longer. She said that what we were about doing Nina. was wrong. So that the we were people are conduits then? Playing God, and she could I think no longer he's trying to make like a master race, isn't he? Or... Or, or they're that, she looks like he's turning them into light bulbs. But the project they, like they 60 watt light bulbs. Kind of incandescent. Yeah. Yeah. Popsicles. Popsicle, ho ho advanced, it could never be fully Remember completed that? until <laughs> What just happened? With your uh Tim, the eyes rolled in the back of your head. <laughs> really? Why the hell yeah. do you need there's, co there's cockroaches coming out of his mouth. Do you remember anything? You what? <laughs> <laughs> What's that red light coming out of his mouth? <laughs> 
I wasn't born. Green liquid coming out of his ears, just steaming. Holes. <laughs> Holes. I was born in the laboratory. <laughs> I was created. Well, there's a pterodactyl in the room. Get it out of here! <laughs> ah, get it! You're getting my dolphin stick. It also works on these pterodactyls. The original. Pterodactyls hate dolphins. Oh, it's like King Kong. My sister Didn't see that scene. Died. <laughs> Don't be so cynical. You see, you should actually feel rather close to me. We're practically related. <laughs> uh oh. You will be closer still when your blood is added to mine to enhance my powers. That'd be interesting and cooperate um, with me, I and guess you can become an important like, part of my reality. You're no relative of mine. I hope it's like Total Recall, and he opens his shirt. <laughs> and I'm not into yeah. Yeah. sister's heads. Yeah. 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 Quato? Yeah. And a liar. Nice. The decision you made. Oh, it's just like Krang from Ninja Turtles, political. like a little glass thing in her head's behind it. Be awesome. Krang's so cool. Yes, he is. He puts himself in a body you know of like a big a dopey dude. Doofus. So don't pretend you're not a <laughs> part of like, the X-ray specs Look and that sometimes is like Godzilla these size. Yeah, he's just, just like a man child. And the <laughs> yeah, they just announced their rebooting Ninja Turtles movies. And it's the guy that the the crew that wrote. Mission Pino. Impossible Ghost Protocol. My oh, cool. Creature. Really? Yeah. New type of Does that mean Pix is that Pixar guy? Or? No, he just directed it. Oh, wrote. Yeah. Right. Everybody's assuming it's going to be blood. CG, but maybe a little the bit more adult. Did anybody see cool. TMNT? I didn't. No, no, I, didn't. I heard it was an Uncanny kill. Valley. Mm -hmm. Do that. Yeah, yeah, I didn't see it. Is no, Eli, Eli Roth is not attached to this one? Did you send him that awesome poster? I forget. Oh, the guy's turtle? Name is? Sorry, I'm I accidentally deleted his contact oh, info exchange. after Hostile 2. Like an incredible act of God. You ever see on Funny or Die when uh, Rowdy Roddy Piper the interviews with Eli Roth on uh, Piper's Pit and surprise him down with a fire extinguisher? So and I want you to watch Hell Comes to Frog Town with me. I'd, I'd watch, I'd watch that. I would watch it. For a twisted pipe yeah, we played so 10 minutes of this kind game, of right? Max? God. And we've been sitting here for 20 minutes I, watching. I kind of want to watch this. Okay. My eminence truly deserves to be worshipped. Let's listen to every word, really. Okay. Was okay. Insignificant. She served her purpose by helping the project. But what's you said that? life when my empire is at stake? My only regret is that she wasn't able to supply us with more blood. In the end, her life was a price to pay. It was the rice to pay. A small price to pay. You... Yeah! Bro! Mommy, mommy, ah! Is that what they say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah you go. Some nerdy Dragon Ball crap. Yeah. What? That's some awesome Dragon Ball crap. Take that it chair. It just glows blue. It's so lame. You dare to test my power? You shall pay for your insolence. Uh oh. Yeah. Insulin? <laughs> oh no. The monologue and all monologues. doesn't pay for my insulin. <laughs> You'll pay for your insulin. Bwah! We'll pay for those transactions, as you once said. <laughs> oh. You'll have Favorite to do better than that, young oh, man, to ben. affect me. See if he's allergic to lightsabers. Man, it's gonna be like an Arkham Asylum ending. So this game has music, huh? Who would have thought? A harbinger. So uh, like Zelda. Yeah, yeah, the the faux uh, yeah. like oh. chanting. I like it. Temple of Time esque. Look at the look at his face right now. Blown <laughs> <his head. laughs> it looks like the Thumb Wars yeah, thing. <laughs> thumb Wars over blood is two. way too high. Float attack eat airborne. Float. <laughs> so hold down. Oh god, this is gonna be awful. It's gonna it? be like balloon fight. It's gonna be great. <laughs> Joust. <laughs> What? Ah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh, it is Dragon Ball! Oh no. Oh my god! Oh, yes! 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 <laughs> yes! What the hell is happening? <laughs> oh, that is so cool! <laughs> yes! <laughs> this is the best fight I've ever seen in my life. You all saw this coming from the first oh room of Overblood 1. From the first room of Overblood oh, 1, you yeah. saw this coming, okay? There was no question the that the series would go gone. in this direction. This is this is <laughs> yes! this is like fighting Wesker in a volcano. Oh, that makes. <laughs> Tim, you got to give a Kamehameha as you shoot it. This is how it's gonna uh, end, isn't it? Yeah. Miami! <laughs> what the hell is this? Oh, this is so. Attack with your laser beam, Akarno. 
This looks kind of easy, too. Well, has he been, like, holding back on us and Akarno had this power the entire time? <laughs> Oh, man. No, no he, he had to eat that grandma. Yeah, he had, to, he had to make fun of his, his sister, basically. <laughs> I'm going to phrase yeah. that differently. Oh, <laughs> this is the hardest thing to aim. <laughs> what? First person will be much better. That guy has even worse aim. <laughs> well, Jeez, like, Louise. Deal. I can't. You have no inventory. You can't <laughs> access your Then inventory. get him. This music is pretty sweet. <laughs> Everything is sweet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, except it, the aiming. I gotta agree with Hanson here. Yeah. This is pretty damn cool. It almost feels like Zone of the Enders. <laughs> exactly like that. <laughs> uh oh. You're on fire or something. Oh, he's getting health back. How did that happen? That jerk. Oh, he's sapping your. So there's no life inventory, force. Tim? Oh. Uh, I'm good. Sure, good. that would I just see that again. start from that point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They wouldn't. No, they wouldn't screw you over that bad. Oh, I can hear the music. We're, yeah, we're you're good. good. You're good. Wait. Very faintly. Good. Okay. Yep. Right down to business here. Oh, <laughs> God, it's the <laughs> worst. <laughs> so how are? Can you explain the controls here? <laughs> you can no, he's on, automatically right? locking on to the uh, the stupid uh, space harrier projectiles. Oh, okay. Wow, this sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. I don't know. I think it looks pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, it looks fine. <laughs> yeah, but doesn't look cool about that. <laughs> oh, the ho! <laughs> <laughs> just headbutts me he in the nuts. Nut, nut taps you. <laughs> yes. All right, that was a good one. Yes. That's dumb, Macarno. Just hit him. <laughs> you know what? If we if we cut this down to the best moments of Overblood Two, this is probably it. No, no, no. I'm just saying, like this. This would be an incredible game. <laughs> oh, like the. Yeah, if I made an Overblood, I think you, a, you a just committed version. yourself to a highlight reel. Oh, I know. <laughs> but it'd just be all the shoutouts to Overblood One and this. No, no all the boss fights moments. are awesome. Junk blade races oh, yeah. and T Rex, T Rexes, the spinning guy with the stick. Yeah, this is going dominatrix, better. the box room, the classic room with the boxes. Yeah, nice. Oh, one more. Yeah. yeah. Eat it. You jump on his head. All right, we gotta pay attention. You got your ass kicked by a grandma. Let's talk it out, buddy. Can you move? Credits. No. Mm. <laughs> are you all right? Yeah, I think so. I'm glad you guys are here. Unfortunately, that they should have put that guy under the elevator. That's not what you would say. You'd be like, holy <laughs> Did you guys see what just happened? I was just like I was in an episode of Dragon Ball Z. I uh, shot like blue energy out of that my, show, right? my chest. 300 years ago? <laughs> yeah, uh, no, I'm, I'm all right. I wish you were wearing your para jacket, Why Tim. is he still walking? That looks so much cooler. I know. Yeah, good music. Enjoy what you've done. <laughs> I hate this. We <laughs> shot him once, then he turned into a big thing, and then he, and then he shrunk, and we could have shot him again, <laughs> and then I shot him with a laser beam. This is the result of your arrogance. Command code number one Sorry. can't even be countermanded by me. The other attacks you witnessed were simulations, staged to get you to cooperate. What? This one There's Metal Gear 2. There's all a ruse. It's all a Solid Snake simulation, yeah. Selection for societal sanity. <laughs> I don't know if anybody's no. ever jinxed each other on there Solid Snake simulation. There isn't. So just sit back. Possibly Kojima <laughs> listening to a recording of himself. It's <laughs> <laughs> the only way that's possible. This can't be happening. <laughs> We've got no choice. We've got to blow this ship to stop. What? No, oh, seriously, what did you, you say? <laughs> you gotta finish your sentences, dude. How do we do it? Your little rabbit minds amuse me so, you fools. Even if you were able to blow up this ship, the explosion would destroy all of the East Edge City. And then what would happen to your... The East Edge of the City or East Edge East Edge City? That's a dumb name. Yeah. Do you guys remember going onto this ship? An explosion like that. Yeah, yeah the big yeah. onion thing. Safe big onion Death Star. Yeah, it was like the Death oh, Star. Okay. Death Star? Death Star? Death Star Docking yeah. Bay. Right above counts. That's fine. Let's be taking a Muay Thai with Dan here. Dan, I was just going to make that. 
have a big bruise on my uh, shin, I think, from where our shins touched. I had something on my elbow. Yeah, that hurt. That hurt my shin. Yeah. Oh, we're back here. <clears throat> Keep that boop boop beep up. Just kill him! He's following <laughs> you! God. Bazooka! You have a bazooka, a machine gun, a laser a gun, a lightsaber, and a hand knife. It's like even Sarah Connor just finished off the Terminator in like a hydraulic press. Yeah. She didn't just try to go home and like act annoyed as she looked, turned around and like it was just his torso following her like to work. <laughs> and she goes back to the restaurant just like crawling down the aisle. It's, it's busting tables. Yeah. <laughs> got a little apron on. That probably won't harm anyone. <laughs> yeah. He's good, he doesn't have legs. He <laughs> doesn't have, like, nuke things in his brain. Did they, was that in 3 that they introduced that? Like, those chips can just make, like, mushroom clouds? Yes. He was really lucky then. Were you upset when R2-D2 had a uh, like, jetpack type thing? No, that was awesome. <laughs> okay. I assume that he never got refilled. Like, his fuel never got refilled. Yeah, he just, he's running around on Tatooine and stuff. Yeah. He could have been using his thrusters, but he never got refilled, so... Why did he tell C-3PO about it? I think they had kind of a passive-aggressive relationship. It, you, it's almost implied that he talked about it a lot, and 3 was really upset with him. Mm -hmm. They didn't have a very good relationship. It always bothered me how, like, at the end of episode 3, they're like, wipe that uh, humanoid droid's memory. But R2-D2 could have explained everything that happened. Yeah. But he's just a dick, and he didn't. It's like, hey, you were made by that Darth Vader guy. You can do what he mentioned it at some point to that guy. What? Do robots nope. ask where they come from? Great book. Thank the makers. Did, <laughs> 3P always said that, so he was cognizant of it, I guess. Thanks. Anakin. Come on, accept he called him Annie, you I think. Annie. Vortex Queen. <laughs> oh God. Bust through the wall. <laughs> that'd be. That'd make this. The. What if that actually happened? The same sprite. It's just like <laughs> the Echo Universe collides with Overblood. <laughs> that'd be cool to put in Smash Brothers. Actually, she's like a trophy. She screams. <laughs> My God. <laughs> Just can't see anything else on the screen. Dolphins fly everywhere. Just throws up dolphins. You antagonists in games have done that. Solidus. I think the origami killer from Heavy Rain. Heavy Rain is the go-to. You saved us. You were great. Oh, ending. I'll fight that thing. To my own people. Overblood three in space. That's a pigs in space reference? Yeah. Nice. I'm oh, old. Yeah, I'm up at space. Yeah, I got <laughs> I love it. We're old. Explain yourself. Hasaka. Reiner has like on? a weird Muppet motif in his mm -hmm. TV room. Be cool. Why are you frowning over that? That's you got, amazing. Like, Muppet bed sheets. I know he's dead. <laughs> well, Muppets yeah. Are awesome. all, all the little beds <laughs> in the TV room. That's a little weird. <laughs> he uh, also has uh yeah i tried to clean that up before you guys came over but uh, i didn't have enough time yeah, just put a sheet over beds we still recognize Sorry. that it's a bed. <laughs> he also scoured freak shows for the largest lady Please he could find and uh, now, all she can only yes. he only ever sees her her it's legs you, and they're wearing she wears in funky socks oh. and a skirt and yeah little animal socks from, yeah. from the muppets calls it calls her nanny it was a nanny reference i got it yeah well it was weird <laughs> oh cool oh, oh, crap. 20 years ago my real Let father, me recite Ryan my Taro speech to the Hayano, UN. Discovered that the world air cooling systems would not last as long. Look at the half-assed animation. No, this is straight out of Star Wars. Wars. Down in approximately ten years. Hey, that's where Yoda so had that lightsaber fight. No. Didn't Yoda the like, use no, fallen things and stuff? The We're Senate gonna go chambers. Yeah, and Palpatine. No, yeah, this you're is thinking of the Galactic Senate. Reiner's thinking of the briefing room. We're gonna go blow up the Death Star. Oh, you're talking about in like Jedi or actually New Hope. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Just Chewbacca superimposed standing next to him. Hillary Clinton. Hide a Chewbacca in there, Hanson. But I soon started listening. What are the odds that wasn't modeled after Hillary Clinton? It's like that? Yeah. Doesn't look like Hillary Clinton. It's a woman in a political thing. It doesn't look like Hillary Clinton. Ah, she's got the same hairstyle. We're having a musical moment here. Do I do a? Fucking away. Over blood two is a game we play, play it anyway. <laughs> the game isn't good, but we play it all day. And so the other right? right? You got yeah. more than that. I don't remember yes. how all the verses go. <laughs> My father was too proud to tell anyone what had happened. The, the, the one time Dan episode. asks well, me to continue singing. <laughs> 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 what is that? What is that? 
What? Oh, they the same so, face. I went off to a new life. While the new oh. Ryuchi Hayano oh. stayed behind to run the company. But although the clone looked and sounded like me, oh. he lacked my conscience, which was nurtured by the kind and loving Masato. I stayed with Masato for years. I can honestly say this is the most confusing, no complex story I've ever been a part of. And when she dies, it's worse than Xenosaga. It's the most confu confusing, complex story that I've never paid attention to. <laughs> Man. turned out to be the whole drive. Damn. That's a hell of a story, pal. But you could have come clean with us a long time ago. Chris is right. We would have been cool about it. <laughs> we we would have been cool about it. We aren't top tight. So, <laughs> the Ryuchi Hayano I knew was more of a fake than even I suspected. Yes. Oh, God. But he was smart enough to fool you. <laughs> Wasn't he, Zeno? <laughs> But you aren't smart enough to know that you can't blow up this ship. You see, I disengaged the self-destruct unit a long time ago. How many bombs so you do you have in your inventory? Ship as high as you Why, want. All of them. Okay. But no matter how high it goes, it will not self-destruct. But it will launch my missiles. How do you like that, Mr. Hayano? Do bad guys have Wrong the same again. missiles like that? <laughs> missiles I required. The self-destruct <laughs> unit. But who said anything about blowing up the ship by engaging the self dest What? Shoot the missiles at itself! Doc, you read me? Roger. Loud and clear. You too, Doc. All three <laughs> of us are okay. a tin can. I want you to go to <laughs> the antimatter room. We'll meet you there as soon as we can. Roger that, Hosaka. <laughs> Blowing up the ship is gonna remind me It's like me Jack Black talking into a walkie-talkie in, uh, was that, uh, Orange him, County sweet. or whatever. Aha! Roger that, Captain. Or no, <coughs> saving Silverman. Like, you don't have to make the <coughs> sound. I just like to think he's making that sound. The movie was kind of funny. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Neil Diamond. Over Early Army. Yeah. yeah. Like Kills a guy with a flag. Well, I was when I lived at my parents' house. I was woken up to my dad riotously laughing. <laughs> and I went upstairs and he's just watching Saving Silverman. Like my dad never reacts to movies ever. Like uh, and he's just losing his shit oh, to Saving Silverman. No. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I can save though. <clears throat> Hanson, how are we doing on time? Woo. Uh, we got like 15 minutes. Seriously, we're gonna have an episode 20. Like Steve the Owl. I don't oh. know, man. Never know. <laughs> I kind of want an episode 20, but I also want to have a pizza party today, so I'm kind of torn. Today, it just <laughs> happens immediately. <laughs> That's how it works with Zelda. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like balloons falling from the sky. Yeah. Just pepperoni pizza. Immediate pizza party. I love those kind. Okay, so you think this is gonna end now with us just blowing up the space station and escaping? Yeah. That's probably it. It has to. I wonder if this like we already had our epic boss battle, right? I can't imagine anything more epic. Yeah. Unless you actually fly this ship. Is that just open into space there? Yes. It's not how things work. Oh. How many space stations have you been on? Yeah. There's a force, there's a force field, field there. Yeah. Oh, uh, there could be. That's how the Death Star worked. Is that how it works in Star Wars? Yeah. There's a force field. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to save them or something. Did anyone pay attention to that? Oh no. I yeah, think go you're... save them. You're gonna save him, or you're gonna blow this place up? God, I'm gonna like start that. walking like that. I'm just gonna make my way to where they are, the diva level. He's training with those new fangled running shoes. Oh, okay. You know, have the toes in them and whatnot. Oh yeah, the, he's got a pair of Vibram. Yeah. I wish I had the Batmaniac suit right now. This be running through the space station. <laughs> are you sure you don't? Man. Yeah, we sold it back so we could afford oh. the pair jacket. Do you have that brown overall suit, or is that what he's wearing right now? <clears throat> Let me see. Yeah. Yeah. It's a Navarro custom. Oh, custom made for Navarro. Yeah. Remember when we first got control of this guy? How in love mm -hmm. with him we were? He had the uh, fire extinguisher. Yeah. His run looks like a P90X like warm up thing. Yeah. High knees. Mm hmm. Yep. Maybe do some butt kicks afterwards. Mm hmm. Who knows? P90 see, jokes. See how our calves are doing. <laughs> I wonder if Tony Horton watches replay. <clears throat> this one, I think he does. I think yeah. Tim Horton does. So you honestly didn't think he had to do anything with this guy. You just got to get up there. I have really no idea um, if he has another objective. He just walks into the room like, what the hell are you doing here, Navarro? <laughs> Hello. Didn't you listen to anything we said? Reverend Horton Heat. Nope. Shut up. <laughs> Reverend Horton Heat. Here's a who. <laughs> All right. What are we thinking now? Uh, I have no idea. Too bad there's not like an objective. <laughs> Thing. 
Turns out it's just got the dead space thing where you click the left stick and it shows a direct Whomp. laser to where you need to go. Whomp. <laughs> oh, there. Um, that was the nicest thing in Dead Space because you want to get everything in Dead Space. Yeah. So like if there's a fork in the road, yeah. you do it and it's going left, the laser's like, well, I'm going to go, go right, right and get yeah. whatever's there. That yeah. was the best. Mm -hmm. I love that. It was like, yeah, because we had some complaints about like uh, Shadows of the Damned where like there'd be forks and you just yep. Yep. didn't know which way to go and then you get cut off. Yep. And, yeah. Oh, I want to play Dead Space. Yeah, that game's great. Mm -hmm. Both of them. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Both yeah. of them are so good. Can't wait for the next one. Nope. Mm, me neither. Oh, hello. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's just dead ahead here. It's just laying there. That is some lazy game design. Are you sure you couldn't have just got in that stupid spaceship and flown away? I mean, I think I would have probably gotten a bad ending. I'm just saying I would have liked that more. You mean just to be done with this? No, just to have some sacrifice in the game, you know? Sure. I want to feel the emotional impact of a Carno going up in flames. Pizza I'm party. I'm the heat. Pizza party. I'm ready to heat it up. You guys uh, ever been to Old Chicago? Had their double decaroni? No, I've Two layers yeah. of cheese, two yep. layers of pepperoni. Ryan, Chicago you... pizza in general. My family's yeah. from Chicago. I spend, like, summers there. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. It's the best place for pizza. You go to Giordano's? Hands Giordano's oh, yeah. stuffed pizza? That yep. is the best pizza I've ever had in my entire life. It's like stuffed a six-inch... Stuff, it's, yeah, yeah. it's giant. It's just filled with meat and cheese. and like there's, It's not like stuffed there's crust, a place, though, is it? It kind it of... Be, it, yeah. It's like a giant... It's like a pie. Yeah, yeah like there, there's a there's a place in St. Paul called the Italian Pie Shop, which uh, is kind of close to that. Um, it's, uh, yeah, it's got, like, the extra crust on top. Oh, God, that stuff is so good. Yeah, Chicago pizza is unbelievable. What the hell's going on here? Yeah, what is that? Force field. You sure? Uh, Wait, didn't we get that key? Can we go back? He just I used, used it. it. Uh huh. I, mm -hmm. What? Hieroglyphs? What is yeah. going on here? What? Can you go around that? Blow it up. Do you have the Rosetta Stone in your inventory? Maybe that wall tells you what to do. Oh yeah, Rosetta the Stone. Book of Medora. I'm gonna look through all this. Horse meat. Can you shove a meat burger into that? <laughs> Slowly it blows up the whole ship. The you ate the horse meat burger? I just ate it. I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah. It's like throwing meat burgers at the Womp Rats back home. Meat burgers? Uh. <laughs> trouser meat. Is worth a shot. What the hell how is that? How did trouser meat come up? I remember that term. I just don't know where that came from. I don't think any of these things are going to work, Tim. I'm gonna shoot it. <laughs> the glass. <laughs> <laughs> that is a stance. That is a Yosemite <laughs> Sam stance there. Well, he's bracing himself. Our nation. It's like SEAL Team 6. <laughs> Someone somewhere. Oh, oh. Damn it. Yeah. Heat pack? Or I don't know. Freeze pack? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> no, <Nope>. you fool! <laughs> <laughs> well, this sucks. <laughs> what a way to end this. Well, thing. there was that fork in the road in the previous room. Well, there's just a shutter, but it's always been closed. Maybe there's something in there that can turn off that force field? I'll check it. Oh, wait. Wait a second. There were those hints uh, in that room where we got all the other hints uh, for the diva pieces. There's some, like, something we have to shoot in order. Here, um, to lower a thing or something? I have yeah. those pictures, I think. Looks okay. difficult to break, but not impossible. Don't say that. <coughs> Didn't shake. Uh, so 16 more of them before what has taught us anything about not, opening doors. I'm not gonna waste it. Cha. Cha. But I'm wondering, you know, if there is some sort of sequence we have to um, uh, input in the engine room. At 12 o'clock, shoot the center. 12 o'clock. Ah. Oh, is that a lion Looks face? Looks like it. With Thrusters on it? Butt thrusters? That is the coolest thing ever. Where is that from? Yeah, that's Last a episode. Lion. Oh, thrusters. you gotta line it up? Break the champion's nose? No, seriously, nose. what was that from? I know it was from the last episode, but what was butt thrusters? Break, I don't mind you being dumb, Break the nose man. of the champion. But when you talk over the other people trying to solve the problem in the game just to be dumb, that's whenever. I'm not that. trying to be dumb. I'm trying to remember what is the butt thruster thing from. That was a Ben Reeves joke from last episode. But from, I know that, but what was happening? He was showing us his butt thruster. I don't know. I don't remember the context. Okay. Man, I don't know. Um, Break the nose of the champion. This next screen I didn't get very well. Something weapons have changed. 
At 12 o'clock, shoot the center. Well, I've got a picture of you taking those pictures, so maybe I could find it. <laughs> you zoom in to his eye, you can see the reflection <laughs> off the screen. Enhance. Man, Break the I, uh, nose I am of the champion. lost here. And there's a nose here on this here lion. I completely understand why this didn't come out. Yeah, me too. You think just somebody from the publisher just played it and realized? Yeah, like, guys, people aren't going to have the patience to play this. Whereas one was a functional game. I think we give one a lot of credit. We still got stuck in one. There's yeah, a lot of one isn't a perfect look, game. We looked up stuff a lot in the walkthrough. Oh, yeah. He jumped there again. I saw that. I'm going to try to take a look at it. And if we had a walkthrough for this one, I think we'd probably be oh, yeah, going constantly. at the same pace, you know? <laughs> Other than one where the guy just gave up. <laughs> Yikes. Talked about throwing a toaster in his bathtub. Oh. I saw that before. Jump. Jump. Ninja. Ninja. Rap. <laughs> I made another funny. <laughs> yes. Love that part. Man, this uh, game likes to throw roadblocks. It's such a Lion weird roadblock, though. You yeah. don't have an invisible wall. Why don't I just make it constant? Hey, zoom in, a, get a little closer, and look up, like at twelve o'clock. This close. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, there's what are those two doors back there? Oh man, this looks like a big area. That looks like a lion's face, right? Yeah. Yeah. For sure. Twelve o'clock. Lion's a champion. I've shot it in the face and its nose with grenades. I don't really... Beyond that. I mean, is there another place to go? Did you try the laser gun? I didn't. Yeah, I'll try the laser gun. That's a good idea. So what happens if you hadn't bought the laser... Yep. What happens if you hadn't nice bought work, the laser man. gun? Nice work, man. High five. Seriously. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. Exhaust every option. Um, and then... Oh, no. What was the next one? Okay. Oh, this is nice. Weapon something? Right? Yeah, this is probably just shoot the weapon. It's like a pack of cigarettes. This is turning into prey. <laughs> really? And then what 12 o'clock. The... Oh, God. Um. Okay, it's getting close. <laughs> oh, my God. This is going to be so annoying if you don't hit it. Tim will. He, he's got this. I believe in you! Oh. Oh, oh okay. no. This is worse <laughs> than the monkey watch in Rhythm Heaven. I wonder if I oh, even God. have to jump. Nothing's that bad. <laughs> Hold on. I'm gonna try to get a better. Did you do the monkey watch? No, I, I tried it a couple times. And I couldn't get it. But okay, I'm, I'm going back to it. I'm gonna monkey get monkey watch. Yeah, there's this monkey watch in Rhythm Heaven Fever, and it's just destroyed everyone in the office. Of course, yeah, said he got it. By that I mean three guys. It's not designed very well. Let me add it. I just don't think we have rhythm. Well, Cork got the first one, but then it does the collection of mini games at the end. Oh, that's where it's tough. Yes, I was oh. not able to get past that. Nice. Yes. Thanks. Hell of a shot, kid. Hey, thanks. Thanks, bar. What next? What? Yeah. <laughs> Chewbacca! <laughs> yeah, he is, he is. Straight from Kashyyyk itself. That's pretty much Chewbacca. With emeralds taped all over his face. Come on, big guy. I'm not going to let the Wookiee win. Yeah. <laughs> what do you got? Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh. Uh-oh. Jeez. Like Whoa! <laughs> he is strong. Fly and shoot lasers at him. So when he does his grand slant... What? <laughs> what? <laughs> That's one tough big guy. <laughs> That's one tough big guy. <laughs> I, want, I want that on a shirt. <laughs> what? Oh, so it's like a thing we are just talking about. Yeah, RPGs. bosses you can't beat. Navarro? I see your friend met my friend. <laughs> I see your friend. Hey, we'll shoot more missiles at your friend. He gets so bored when there's nothing for him to do. Navarro. We gotta get him. Let's go. We'll make sure Navarro's <laughs> okay. So fast. Then blow the ship up. What about him? Hanson, we're probably gonna have to wrap up after this cutscene, aren't we? Mm. He's so twenty minutes from now. Besides. The ship's We're gonna have an episode twenty, but no pizza. Oh, how will I survive with <laughs> you no really want that pizza? I don't know, the pizza sounds good. I think you're just hungry right now. Yeah, it's probably it. it's lunchtime. I don't think you want overblood to end it all. I do want to get on to the next one, especially if it's Psychonauts. Well, we don't know what the next one is. I know. Those fools. They 
can't beat Tempest. <laughs> <laughs> Tempest is the name of that wookie? Oh, he's talking about the old arcade game, Tempest. Oh, you yeah. Can't we can't Tempest. beat it. Yeah. No one beats Tempest. And I thought Grim Fandango won. Like, it was close, but my my vote counts for like a thousand. Um, I believe Psychonauts had a pretty. Yeah, it was a head there, but once my so vote went there, you gotta multiply that times a thousand. And they both sound awesome. He's, not attacking. So. he's programmed to guard that door. <laughs> no kidding. He won't do anything to us unless we try. He's got a little camel toe going on there too. Aw, oh, Dan. <laughs> don't look there. No to really, just don't go down there. Uh. There's only one thing to do. What's that? Look up Looky there. Toe. Arcano, check it out. What's that? You should recognize it. Ceiling. <laughs> it's one of those giant metal room divider walls, like the one in the shuttle giant down from the ceiling. Room. I got you. <laughs> All we got to do is get that big lug under this thing. Hold on. And then squash him like a giant tin can. Okay. Bingo! You this got it. important. I Just then like remember to get the shiny All on top. All we got to do is lure him in this direction. I'll do it. If I don't, the old man here might try again. And this time, he may not survive the exercise. Exercise. So they build this <laughs> no awesome sweat, robot designed to kill, but it's only programmed to guard the door. Yeah. Yes. In the room with a big thing that can fall on him and kill him. He caused more than a certain amount of damage okay. to start walking. Lure him under the gate. Yeah. Really lets you discover how to beat these bosses. <laughs> Zelda. Don't do that. So you complain when they don't tell you anything, and you also complain when they tell you exactly what to do. Yes. Okay. Oh, we jump in time. Uh oh. Oh, so it's like Morton Koopa Jr. Morton Koopa Jr.? He's one of the Koopalings. Is he, he, wasn't he in What Dreams May Come and Jerry Maguire? <laughs> Yeah, that guy can backflip. Oh, Q. Oh, it's a Cuba getting junior thing. And uh, Chill Factor with Skeet Ulrich about the ice cream truck bomb. Remember that? They were driving an ice cream truck around with Skeet Ulrich and it's going to explode? What are you talking about? Chill Factor, look it up. No. Came out probably early 2000s. I'm going to delight in not looking that up, Dan. Cuba getting junior and Skeet Ulrich with an exploding ice cream truck. That's the whole movie. And Snow Dogs. You know, the close up's not necessary. Snow One time, uh, my dad was talking. He's like, Hey, uh, last night I saw this movie called Snow Dogs. It just, <laughs> it just made me cry. Was he being serious? Yeah. I'm like, what do you mean? It just made me cry. They had beautiful shots of mountains. <laughs> and the dumbest poster in movie history. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't Cuba Gooden Jr. in that one? Yeah, it's just his head surrounded by dogs. <laughs> and, and, he's sm and he's smiling really huge with the big furry like hood thing on. And just nothing but dogs for the rest of the poster. It sounds pretty awesome to me. Dogs all the way down. I see. I saw Hanson writing down a time code, so I assume you all just saw the poster of Snow Dogs. You think you're hitting this guy? He's walking. Okay, he's <laughs> like an idiot. <laughs> just really Ooh. dumb. He has to use his arm momentum to move. <laughs> I'd like to see him in a fashion show. It's like uh, that Seinfeld, <laughs> the salami hands, or salami arms, the lady that just doesn't move her arms when she uh, walks. Molly Shannon. Oh, was it? Mm -hmm. That's right. Remember when she left SNL to be a big movie star and it totally worked out? Like everyone that leaves SNL? Yes! All right. I mean, I mean to remember that. <laughs> That's why I'm saying yes to that. <laughs> Come on, pal. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Just gone. They didn't even try to include a sound effect or any kind of dead there's, body. There's a weird sound effect, actually. Yeah, the actually. door screamed. Oh, the door, yeah. Well, the door, yeah. We named the door, Indy. Come on, Ben Reeves, you're better than that. It's weird that Ben ran down here just for that joke. Just yeah. Busted through the ceiling, said it. And it was weird. There. Didn't know our ceiling did that. Yes! This is where oh! you flamethrower with the lasers! Oh, flamethrower lasers! <laughs> you guys, Fine. You guys want to get nuts and beat it? Uh, I'd rather just have pizza. Well, this would mean we do get pizza. He oh! was making a joke about how he doesn't want to eat nuts, he wants to eat pizza. Oh, thanks, Dan. You want to get nuts? <laughs> Let's get nuts. We should wrap up the episode here, right? Yeah, All right. I you're think probably so. right. Because we have, we have opportunities. We're going to have a five-minute episode next time. There's probably going to be like... Another fight. And you think? another 20-minute yes. exposition about what's going yeah, on. Yeah, that's true. All right. We get the episode 20 that everyone's been petitioning for on the internet. Um, so, yeah. Hang on, and we will get to that next. Thank you for watching. We're good. That chocolate chip cookie was delicious. What did it sound like? Well, I didn't know if you were finishing <laughs> my sentence. Just said, delaying no. finding your spirit mm. animal with every cookie. <laughs> That's the best way anyone's test, ever test. tried to make me feel bad for eating a <laughs> snack. <laughs>
<laughs> You'd be a good personal trainer, just yeah. super vague. If you ever want to be Night Wolf, stop eating that cookie. <laughs> what? Oh, he ate a cookie, so he's not going to find a spirit animal for another like two weeks. Oh, yeah, we were talking about a spirit animal. <laughs> I think Tim would be a coyote. Really? Think I'm mm. kind of a scavenger? I'd go with banana slug. Banana slug. Polar bear. They're all wildly different animals. <laughs> <laughs> Episode 19. Yeah. <clears throat> ah! That's a Ben Reeves contribution. <laughs> oh, oh, we're actually doing one for lunch. Look at this. Look at it. Look at it. Look at that thing. We got it early. <laughs> Popsicle. Ho, ho. Sorry about that. <laughs> Green liquid coming out of his ears. Just steaming. <laughs> Oh, friend, <laughs> I see your friend. Hey, we'll shoot my missiles at your friend. Also, just wanted to give a quick shout out to, uh, actually, I'm not going to start with that. Also, also, scratch that. We just wanted to give, it a, give a quick shout out to Ross, who uh, helped us out with some very useful emails. And uh, it's him and his twin brother's birthday. Happy or it was birthday. actually Happy birthday. Hey, exactly. yeah. Happy birthday. It was actually episode 19 was the day uh, that uh, his birthday. He was born on uh, Super Replay over blood to episode 19, uh, I think like 30 years ago. So happy birthday. This is probably his best best birthday ever. I, oh, yeah, yeah. I know it is my best Ross birthday. So this has already gone on too long. Happy birthday. <laughs> this isn't a regular thing. <laughs> Yeah, you really? can cut that down. <laughs> cut that down to being very sweet. Happy birthday, Ross, and your brother. Happy birthday. That's a <laughs> optional one too. Thanks for the emails. Master Black. We also wanted to say happy birthday one? to Ross. We also wanted to say happy birthday to Ross and his brother, and thanks for the uh, Overblood Two tips. Thanks, Ross. Happy birthday. Thanks. What was that? Oh, yeah. Thanks. He's giving you yeah. options. My air horn. Don't give me options. That's the worst thing you can do to a video guy. Hey. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, What is that from? I don't know. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah.